Motorsports. Today I'm going to show you a 1963 Chevrolet Impala SS. This is a total Boulevard Cruiser. It has a set of 20 inch Riddlers up front and 22s in the rear. The tires have 95% tread. It's powered by a 350 small block. It has power assist brakes. It has cold AC, so a vintage air system. It has a really cool stereo inside with four speakers and uh, you can plug your phone into it with Bluetooth, I believe as well. I'm gonna go ahead and open up the hood real quick. Paint's really nice. Uh, you got your insulation here. There's your 350, uh, brand new alternator, vintage air, power assist brakes, uh, power steering, and a brand new battery as well. So while I close that, listen, there's no rattles going on. Paint is very deep, shows super nice. I'd rate it an eight out of 10 in regards to luster. As we walk down the sides of it, I want you to take note of how nice the body panels are. So when you stand here, uh, you can see a little bit of waviness, but it's not too bad. Um, small imperfection right here. And there's some water rolling down here, but that's not anything. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and keep on going to the rear. The roof looks awesome. So there's no, not a single dimple in it, and it's super shiny. I'm actually, it's blinding me. You've got SS emblems in the rear because it is an SS. Uh, rear tail looks great. Chrome looks great. Your bezel looks great as well. Lights work as they should. Uh, reverse lights do not operate when you put it in reverse. We're gonna go ahead and walk down the side here. You can see those big 22s in the rear and this thing rides really nice, nice and smooth. Uh, when you go over bumps, it is a little bit firm because it's a smaller profile tire. Tr dual exhaust, true dual exhaust. I'm gonna go ahead and open up this door. Take a look at the interior. That Canon does not come with the purchase, but it's got a beautiful red interior. It is a uh, automatic transmission. Dash is in excellent condition, as is the steering wheel. Um, when you look at the, the seats, the seats are great. Then when you look at the rear, the carpet looks great, and your headliner, take a look at the top of that headliner. Unbelievable condition. As I close this door, take note of those three vents on the bottom. Those things blow ice cold air towards you. So when you put these windows up, which is pretty neat, it's all, they're all tinted. So you've got about 20% tint, 25% tint on all the windows except for the windshield. It keeps it really cool. Especially with a black car, that's difficult to do. Let me open up this trunk. Trunk is extremely clean. You've got yourself carpet throughout. Um, this trunk pan as well, there's no rust. Everything is solid. Overall, extremely nice. I think we should go for a ride. Let's do it. We're sitting inside the Impala right now. Take a note of how nice this dash is. All the, all the bezels and gauges are in excellent shape. There's no hazing. Uh, all you do is flip this switch and it fires right up. Nice and easy. Uh, you have an aftermarket radio, which sounds great. Cash.com. I was driving in my car. Well, if you had a song on it, it'd be better, but you have four speakers, uh, two up front and two in the rear um, for the air condition. So all you do, it's a vintage air setup, so you have three vents here. Let's lower this. You just turn on your fans, and it'll blow cold air towards you and your patron. Let's go ahead and go for a ride. So what we're gonna do is first, I wanna show you that the windshield wipers work as they should. You've got windshield wipers. Um, you also have a sprayer, but the sprayer is not connected. You have your lights, which operate as they should. And uh, this is your shift mechanism. So right now we're gonna go into reverse. We're gonna go ahead and back up a little bit so that we can let this big truck out and then we will go forward. Let's go ahead and turn right here and then we'll be able to test it out. Brakes feel great as well, power brakes. It has drum on all four corners, but the power assist does help tremendously. It, exhaust sounds great. Shifted into second right now. Let's go ahead and turn on to Ravenswood, which is our test track. And we'll get it to operating speed. Nice and smooth. We're going 40 miles an hour right now with no issues. Um, it's actually a really cool car to drive. Suspension feels good. And every single person that we've driven by so far has given us a thumbs up. So if you guys have any questions about this car, please don't hesitate to give us a call. 954-363-2261. We ship worldwide and we can also assist with shipping on a vehicle that's not purchased from us. 
Have a great day.